girls and hey little boys so this is kind of awkward because there's people around me and i'm trying to speak a little loud so you guys can hear me but i'm here my first sonogram appointment well it's not my first sonogram appointment it's my first sonogram appointment in the states because i went in dr i just never show you guys those clips i'm gonna put those clips in right now we are pregnant they spelled my name wrong so wow but yeah we're pregnant in this bitch positive positive got a whole little baby in my stomach or whatever <laughs> Yes, I can hear it. here i can't really record well i totally forgot to record not that i can't really record i just totally forgot to record when i was on my way here fake wow but i'm just here in the waiting room for them to call me and yeah i'm gonna show you guys around okay. So they're making me feel this form out. I'm just here putting this form out. By the way, guys, this is the hospital that I'm giving birth in. I didn't want to give birth in this. I wanted to give birth in the other Presbyterian, but whatever. The other hospitals for like babies at high risk, but only because of COVID. Because the other hospitals where I was born and where I, all my family members are born, so that kind of sucks. I wanted to, well, not all my family members, because I have two cousins that were born in this hospital, and I have a niece that was born in this hospital. I believe I have another cousin that was born in this hospital, but still. I wanted to give birth in the other one but it's whatever as long as my baby is happy and healthy and an active little baby 
Forgot to record again, but I'm here in Target because I need to buy a bio oil since mine ran out. And hopefully, I don't buy more stuff. I'm just trying to buy only a bio oil. And Target, Target does something to me, so let's just go to the bio oil section because I already want to buy so Oh man, I cannot buy nothing. All right, let me relax. I'm just gonna try to avoid the the craft sections because that's the section that fucks me up. This natural beauty. I'm guessing will be here. I cannot find this bio oil and the guy that I asked don't know shit. <laughs> like I asked him and he didn't know where it was. And then somebody else asked him for something and he didn't know where it was. And then somebody else asked him for something and he didn't know where it was. So I'm convinced this nigga, I don't fucking know, he don't know shit. Ah, <sighs> so annoying. So I had to FaceTime my sister because I couldn't find it, but they don't have the actual bio oil. They have the travel size bio oil here. And I just found this. So I'm, what I'm gonna do is just calculate how many ounces is in the actual bio oil, and just buy a whole bunch of the little ones so it completes one big bottle of bio oil. Right here, they're right here. Let me see how many. How many? This is not hectic, guys. So that line is so crazy, like, can you guys see? This is just crazy. Like, everything about this coronavirus shit is crazy. Wow. So I just came out of Target. Yo, I, can't, I really cannot believe that they really stopped selling plastic bags in the States. In the United States. Because in the yard, they don't go buy that shit. Even though they should. But they gave me the little paper bag. Now I'm going to my aunt's house because my sister's there. And I'm just gonna go be with my sister and then we're gonna go to my grandma's house after. Oh, I ran out of breath like so quickly. <sighs> oh my god. Well, first I'm gonna go to Dunkin' Donuts now. And I'm getting my sister a fucking coffee. The bitch is getting this her second coffee of the day. And I, I told her, excuse me, you don't want food? You want fucking coffee? She's like, yeah, she was debating. She's like, should I get coffee? Yeah, just give me this coffee. Just give me this coffee. You little cracker. Ooh, I don't know if I should get $1 medium hot coffee with any sandwich. Oh, not that. I just don't know if I should get a sandwich or a donut. I don't fucking know. I don't know. And I just ate a hot dog. Uh, making poor life choices. But yeah, I don't know. This is when I wish you guys could talk. Because I really am very decisive. Walking into Target. Bitch, what? I'm walking into Dunkin' Donuts, I mean. Let me see. Let me see what I'm gonna get. So 
I don't know where she got a sandwich. I put my donuts in there. And I just got my iced coffee. I'm waiting for the bacon, egg, and cheese. <coughs> See how I told you guys I was gonna. I don't know if I should get a bagel or bacon, egg, and cheese. I just got both. I'm fat ass. I'm not fat ass. I'm in my aunt's building now. Ooh, my lips are crazy. It's just structure. Did you have to close the lady? I don't know. I can't see her. This little boy doesn't like to get his hands dirty. So I put the donut there so he go grab it and instead of grabbing it, this is how he's eating. Here we go. I'm leaving my aunt's house now. She gave me this. This is called the bouncer. It's the little things that babies lay down on and it vibrates and has the little toys. And she got me some clothes too. My sister's holding it for me. And I'm here out of breath, regular. Where's my sister? I'm showing your legs. No. Why, your legs are bad? <laughs>